Why is it that they never get out of my way? I could be literally at their house and they won't be there, but I'm in the middle of nowhere and they're all over me and they won't get, I, I just want to build. I just want to build. Ioni, I will trap you in here. I will, I will bury you all alive inside this cliff if you do not leave me alone. Go away. I'm just trying to build. Thank you. Bye. Hello and welcome back to another Animal Crossing speed build. We're chugging right along with this island. Um, if you forgot what this island's name is, it's Elder Moon. I don't really talk about the island name very much. I name these islands and then sometimes I even forget what I've named my islands. Um, it, for example, my Forever Forest Island, which is supposed to be like you know, the final, like it's on my switch and I don't want to reset it and blah, 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 blah. I am um, in the entrance speed build, which if you want to see, I can put it up in the corner above. Um, I literally had to stop recording the voiceover so I could see what the name of the island was because I couldn't even remember my own forever island's name. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so what we are doing today on this glorious, glorious island is we are doing um, we're a little walkway to Diana's house, which Diana um, owns and runs a spa. So she has like a little reception area where you check in, you get your robe, um, and then across from the walkway of her house, you have the waiting area where you have some magazines and just nice little cozy seats to sit, all of that. And then her spa is actually on the beach. So all of that is in here. Plus we also have Nooks, which is right down the pathway from her. And then on the beach directly below Nooks is like a little hangout spot. Like Nooks is kind of like the corner store, like before you go to the beach, like you get your snacks and your drinks and all of that fun stuff and then like if you want to take a break from the beach then you have like tables and stuff like that to like sit down and um eat or just chill and watch the waves whatever so that's all that's in this build it's still i managed to keep it short um a little short not very much but a little bit it's quicker it's quicker it's longer than just five minutes lately some of the speed builds that i've been putting out are like five minutes long um, I don't know if that's a good thing or not, so we'll try this. This is about 15 minutes long, so let's see how long you can stay on the video. <laughs> I'm just kidding. So right now we're just doing the pathway. Again, it's all normal clutter. It's a fairy forest island, so it's just going to be clutter, greenery, all of that good jazz. Of course, I get stuck and have to get um, Rosetti to come rescue me like probably three times throughout this build. You won't see it, but I just got rescued a second ago before it cut to over here. This is the walkway, and then this is Diana's house. So we're, what we're about to do is we're about to, here in a little bit, start on her reception area. I think it's really cute. Um, stream helped me a lot. If you didn't know, I stream pretty much Monday through Friday. It's normally, I start anywhere between 9 and 10 a.m. Central Standard Time. Um, and normally I stream for about four hours and we do a lot of Animal Crossing. Lately we've been doing a lot of Paleo. We did, um, spoiler alert, we did actually finish this island on stream this week. Mm-hmm. I think it was like on Wednesday this week. Today's Friday, June 21st. Pretty sure we finished it like two days ago. Uh, we, I only have my interior of my house, which I'm going to record on my own. I'm not going to put anyone through any more of this island because I love this island to death, but I am so done do you know if if you play animal crossing which i'm guessing you do since you are watching when you've been going at an island for so long it takes me forever to finish an island right so i've had this island for like a year year and a half and we've been going hard on it so it ha it's only been a few months and we've gotten pretty far we finished it finally but i'm just over it like i love it i i love forest islands but i'm ready to go to the next theme the next theme is not foresty it's gonna have naturey bits but i'm excited to go to the next so i'm just gonna do my interior as a video just a little speed build video of all what i do in the house i really don't know what i'm gonna do in the house i kind of don't really like interiors i don't feel like they're my strong suit um, I am more of an exterior Animal Crossing kind of gal. Um, so we'll see how it works. I, I'm excited. I also am trying to find someone to draw a map 
for me for my Animal Crossing island. So the DA will be really soon. Right now, what we are working on, this is the little waiting area I was talking about. Isn't this cute? I don't see like a lot of like waiting areas just out and about on islands. I don't feel like maybe I haven't toured a lot of islands. I mean, lately, I don't really know. Maybe there is, but I thought like the little reception area and then the little waiting area right across is super cute and then there's a little ladder to your right over here by the tree you can see the stones that's how you'll get down and go to her spa and you'll see that here in a little bit but anyway i think it's really cute and i feel like we did a, a few things on this island that i never thought that i would do because i don't mm -hmm. i never thought i would be good at it you know what I mean? It's like we put a, a playground in the neighborhood and that's kid core. I mean, no matter if it's on a fairy forest island or not, it's kid core. And I'm normally not one to ever do that. I'm normally not one to ever really... I like when other people do it, but to me, I just... It's just not... You know, I'm surrounded by kids in my real life, so I don't really decorate kid core. <laughs> but we did that and then... Um, there was, there was something else that I don't remember, but we've put in a few things that I'm like, you know, I didn't think that I could pull this off, but here we are and we did it. A lot of it is my stream, like I said. So if you ever want to come and see the chaos and the madness live or put your input in live, um, just make sure you hit the little notification bell because that way you get notified on your phone when I go live. It's normally, like I said, it, it's normally when people go are at work, so it may not be easy for you to come in, but it'd be nice. Plus, my birthday's coming up on the 28th, and we're doing a 12-hour long stream, and I will be on actually this time, because we've done 24 hours in the past, but that was an idle stream. This is me playing for 12 hours, so there's going to be games that, um, that we play together. I found some adorable adorable demos of a few games like three different games that i'm super excited to try and i think it's gonna be just fun we're gonna i'm i'm have a giveaway in mind i don't really know all the details just yet i'm planning that now and i'll have all those details out on monday so look forward to that i'm very excited to spend it with y'all and then later in the evening i'll spend it with my husband of course his birthday is actually on sunday we're two days apart so that will be fun he'll be hung over for his birthday but i'll be playing video games all day for mine so i feel like that's that's i got the the really good end of the deal right now what we are doing we just finished nooks <clears throat> and our we had our little setup out there showing kind of all the snacks and stuff you can get now down here is like it's not really a cafe it's just like a hangout chill kind of spot like if because over on the right we put down some like beach towels and like there's a lifeguard stand and all that so it's like you go to the corner store and you sit there and you watch the beach or maybe you have a table and that's where you put all your stuff so that way you can go sit on the towel for a little bit or just whatever it turns out it turns out super cute i really really love mismatching furniture i feel like this game has i used to be such a matchy matchy kind of gal like i get that from my grandmother i call her momo but i get that from my mo my mom's mom she was always um everything that she wore had to match i mean like she also didn't have her ears pierced, so she would make earrings for her outfits out of the spare buttons that would come with her blouse. And yes, I say blouse because that's what she called it. It probably is a blouse. I just find that like an old school term. Don't don't laugh at me. Anyway, so even like, I mean, and if it was pink, her earrings, of course, were the buttons off of her shirt. So those matched. And of course, maybe the pants wouldn't be pink, but they would be like white or they would do something. Her shoes would be pink. Her purse, she would change her purse. So everything in my brain always had to match 100%, like no matter what I did. But this game, like you can decorate and it doesn't have to match. I absolutely love decorating with mismatched items. I feel like it gives a lot of character. Um, but we're at the final part of this. This is Diana's spa where you can, um, you know, get a nice massage you could take a mud bath you can um we have a little line to like dry your clothes off from the beach and all of that good jazz but we're pretty much at the end i babbled about pretty much everything but this build at this point and i'm very sorry if you ha you're still here um but thank you for still being here i'm about to show you around i hope you enjoyed this speed build and i will get your thoughts at the end okay i'll see you in a minute love you bye
What do we think? I think it turned out absolutely adorable. Now with this build being done, that concludes this whole right side of the island. Now what we have left is the left side, um, which is uh, the transition area to go to Bo's house. Then the transi transition area to go to the sunken pathway to the sunken garden and then also to Abel's and then to my house, blah, blah, blah. So we still have a few speed builds left before we conclude this island. I will also be putting out um, a DA tour, but I'm going to wait to put that out, of course, until I get all of the speed builds caught up. So that way it's not like, well, here's the whole island, but then, you know, the next day I'm putting up a speed build for the island you just watched. So look out for that. We will have a lot of videos here coming up. And also we will be starting a new island on next Friday, the birthday stream I was telling you about. We will be starting... Um, restarting this island over so I hope you join because you can come over to the island we're going to have a little birthday party drop some things off if you want to right on the board so we can cherish it forever and um, anyway thank you for being here and don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already and I will see y'all next time love you later bye